Hey guys, happy Friday. I am in London right now, about to leave actually. Uh, I am in town on business. I just wanted to show you in my hotel room, like, what is this? Like, there are literally no other decorations on the wall except for this wire mesh, like, buttocks man I don't know I don't know either way uh, I am on a client site right now I posted that I was gonna be in London for business all week and someone commented on my Instagram like sometimes I forget you have a real job and I was like girl me too <laughs> like but for those of you that don't know in addition to owning my shop in addition to posting videos on YouTube I also work for a telecommunications software company so we were actually on site in London at a customer site been meetings all week it's been going really well but I'm gonna be glad to get home okay so a couple of things I know a lot of people ask when I go out of town or when I'm not in my normal routine I don't focus on staying keto like I can't do it just because it it takes up too much of my mental real estate wondering okay how am I gonna find keto options in a place that I'm not used to when the client is buying the food everything I just don't focus on it I focus on making the best choices that I have with what I have so I've been having some fish and chips I'll say I might have been having a baguette or two if you will and that's okay because I'm not in my regular routine and as long as I get back home and get to my routine this week of being at a client site of being in a different country is not going to derail all of my progress but i did want to come on here and tell you okay just to get ready for when i get back for meal prep this sunday you guys i am challenging myself for the all of next week no artificial sweeteners what ah no <laughs> if you remember from a couple of weeks ago when the basic challenge for myself was just girl eat your meal prep for six days when that's all I wanted to do I'm just I'm still keeping this back here you guys when that's all I wanted to do was be able to just stick to my meal prep for six days I did that and I made myself so proud and I was like I want to challenge myself again even further and do you know what that's gonna be it's giving up the sweeteners it's giving up sucralose mm. do you know what that means <laughs> no zip is <laughs> No Powerade, no ice drink, no Jello, no gum. Like you guys, challenging myself. You know, once again, I thought that getting off the Atkins bars was gonna be removing the crutch that I needed, but I just replaced that stuff with sucralose laden treats you know I try to convince myself oh I'm not having these other things but I just brought sucralose like way I just elevated it I put it sucralose on a pedestal and I need to stop that so I'm challenging I'm challenging myself just six days no sweetens sweetens no sweeteners or sweets for six days now I will be able to have stevia if I want so that means I will be drinking Zevia I do remember back to my uh, to my olden days that did help me and that did make me be able to stick to the plan without having all these other sweeteners so I will just be having Zevia this week and I can do it and that's okay why am I doing it am I doing it because sucralose is bad because it's evil you should never eat it no I'm just doing it because I recognize that I'm using it as a crutch to not really be eating the best quality food that I know I can be eating. So I'm cutting it out just for six days. Not forever, you guys, <laughs> not for 30 days. No, no, just six days. And if I like the way that it makes me feel, maybe after ice cream Sunday, cause you know, I'm, you know, I'm having ice cream Sunday. I'll go back to doing it for six more days. You know, it's all about just guessing and checking and trying to see what works for you and experimenting. And if you like it, do it again. If you don't try something else, but I am committing next week for meal prep, no artificial sweeteners. So I wanted to come on here and tell you, are you going to challenge yourself next week? Comment down below. Do a challenge just for six days you know what have you been leaning on or depending on that you know is like really not helping you reach your goals but like it's delicious and you love it we can give that up for six days we can substitute find something else a healthier alternative just six days <sighs> okay guys that's it that's all i wanted to tell you i just wanted to get you ready so that on sunday we can be prepared now you will know on my sunday meal prep i will be having 
I will be having the zip fizz because I'm not starting this till Monday. <laughs> but just know, get ready. Next Monday, let's challenge ourselves. Let's figure out what we need to do. All right, I'm really hopping off here. Sorry that you don't get to see any more of butt men, but I'm going to the client site and by the time you see this, I'll be on my way back to America. So I cannot wait till I touch back down and I will let you guys know when I make it safe over on Instagram, okay? I hope you had a good week. I've had a great week. Don't stress, if you haven't been reaching your goals, it's okay. We got next week, we got today, we got tomorrow, you know? Get it together, figure out what you need to do and do it. Okay, that's all I got. I'm really I'm really leaving now. Okay, bye.